hello guys so i want to do a quick review i normally hardly ever do anything in the car but this prompts immediate attention it's not even about to wait for me to get home um i hope y'all can see that i look crazy do you see this i have one eyelash over here and then this eyelash is completely gone let me explain why and not only that i'm about to tell y'all where i went to because they they playing games and we're gonna i'm gonna play and i'm gonna play better so anyway so i went to this lash place in reynoldsburg ohio called modern beauty i'm gonna get their address in a mini because i'm doing a review on google as well for them but anyway um i just got my lashes done on sunday i go there every two weeks every two weeks to get my lashes done faithfully i have been getting my lashes done for the past six months no problem every two weeks so this is the second time that the lash has fallen off on one side and um I'm not walking on oh, all that sorry, ice in the curve. <laughs> have a good night. All right, give me one moment. I'm about to pull over so that I can finish doing this. I'm picking up my order and then I'm about to go home and take these lashes off and go somewhere else so they can get fixed tomorrow. <clears throat> okay so as i was saying um i go there every two weeks for the last six months since my birthday i have been going only this is the second time it's dark in my car because they i want y'all to be able to see um the, the second time that it has happened that it has come off on one side and this is the second time that they tried to attempt to make me pay full price for their lack of being able to do their service the way they're supposed to and not stand it behind their work now mind you i did not go in there and ask them for no free service i said can i get the fill in rate they they know that they just saw me in there a couple of days ago sat there in my face because i they was like yeah you come in here every two weeks because i these other ladies were in there it was their first time and they're asking me questions about getting my lashes done or whatever so anyway um so i was going to pay the money just because of the convenience factor that I don't like to record without my lashes done. Like I look, I look a fool right now. I look crazy, and I wanted to record videos. So you, you messing up my time. You messing up my money at this point. So anyway, back to the review. The lady in there was so very rude and very um unprofessional because so when she was telling me the prices or whatever she was like you won't have to pay full price for this and she was like we'll just do a, a fill-in to fix this you you see me doing this your lashes not supposed to be doing this so anyway so i get into the chair and she was like okay well these are coming off so you're gonna just need to soak these off and then just get a new whole new set i was like i know it's coming off that's what that's what i told y'all that it was coming off why is it coming off and i just got my lashes done like a couple of days ago and you trying to make me pay full price you, what, that don't even make no sense so so i'm like in my camera looking at my lashes or whatever because i'm like this don't even need to be soaked off like this is about to fall off when i um i washed my face i got up for yesterday go to work wash my face and my, half my lashes came off when i washed my face that is not normal that's not supposed to happen so i wasn't even like i was irritated but i'm like okay because the last time sorry the last time when i went they was like um just call us and let us know and we'll take care we'll take care of that so anyway so i called them yesterday um after i got off of work i didn't have a chance to go up there because my work schedule it was closing so i was like i'm gonna come today when i'm off so i um go up there the girl's very like i said very rude and very dismissive also um which i'm gonna talk to the manager too so because the last time that i was there which i completely glazed over it because i'm like i'm not a, i don't make a big deal about stuff but one thing you're not gonna do is be dismissive to me and think i'm about to be spending my money there so anyway she the last time maybe like a month or two ago made a comment about my birthmark and she was like um what happened it looked like somebody hit you in your face and like just start laughing it off or whatever and i was looking like what are you talking about you know like it's a birthmark um so that was very rude very disrespectful so i'm like okay clearly you're very rude y'all don't have no customer service and then you got me fucked up <laughs> like i'm trying not to cuss in this video so anyway so to, back to today 
I'm in the chair because I was going to go ahead and pay for it, even though it's not, no fault of mine. And I told her, I was like, it's not about the money. It's about the principle. The worst thing you could do to me is be dismissive. And she was very dismissive. I was like, first of all, you messed up my lashes. You're inconveniencing me. Nobody has not even apologized to me. And now you're telling me you about to add on all these extra tick charges and then you being rude on top of it like girl it, girl <laughs> let me calm down so anyway um but okay so let me tell you i went and got my nails and my feet done and the place closes at seven i got there at 5 30 maybe 5 35 45 they close at seven um so she had two people in there and both of the people left like they didn't even really greet me when I got there because I know she recognized me and know that I called in yesterday so anyway after the last person left she was like okay um what are you here for and I was explaining it to her and everything and so then she gave me one price and when I get in the chair she gives me another price and I was like I really don't feel like I should be paying for this because you're gonna have to meet me in the middle somewhere like I'm not and she kept saying you don't get free service you don't get free service only after 24 hours never once did I ask for free for service never once did I ask for free service I was like give me the fill in rate like give me a discount take five dollars ten dollars off or something to try to say eradicate your wrongs acknowledge your wrongs and so then she was trying to argue with me and she was like the lady who did uh your lashes she don't be having no problems and I was like that's not the truth because the last time I came in here my, my lashes came off before and I didn't even say anything I didn't even make a big deal about it I'm like this is the second time so I'm like I'm clearly bringing this to your attention that there is a problem because I know for a fact that it lasts for two weeks because I've been getting it done for the past six months so all of a sudden now and it's not me so then she's gonna try to say some well you know like your mask could be making it what are you talking about I don't wear makeup all the time my mask don't be by my eyes so what are you talking about so <laughs> it, it's just very much so a lack of accountability that was really getting on my nerves and then the dismissiveness like that is with oh oh my god <laughs> so anyway so i'm sitting in the chair and she was like um so are you getting your lashes done or not because we don't have all day and i'm looking at because i was like excuse me um it was nobody else in there and so clearly once she saw my face she tried to switch it up because she was like well i'm just saying because it can take some time and i'm looking like do you have other customers because there's nobody in here right now first of all second of all you need to be focusing on me and trying to fix this situation third of all not talking to me out the side of your neck like you crazy um because i don't have to spend nothing here not one red penny and um yeah so pretty much I was like, I'm not paying y'all and I'm not coming back. I will find somebody else to do my lashes. I'm gonna go home, take these lashes off and find somebody else. And they're about to get the worst review ever. And I'm about to make everybody else in my family give a review and see whoever else I can get to give a review. Because the one thing you're not gonna do is play with me, play with my money and play with my time. And you've done all three. It's a problem. It's a very big problem. So yeah, so I just wanted to, to, to go ahead, <laughs> get it how it is when i'm fresh and frustrated because when i go home i don't be all right i'm gonna be cool i'm gonna go home take these lashes off and it's gonna be fine and i'm gonna find somebody else to do my lashes tomorrow and it's gonna be cool but what you're not gonna do like i said is play with me and sit there and act like it's okay and act dismissive towards me because i you're losing a customer over five or ten dollars because it's the principal because you want to be an asshole and I'm, like I said, I'm telling everybody else that I know. I don't even take the time out to do Google reviews and all this other stuff. I have the time today. We got the time today because she was very rude, very nasty, and very dismissive. And like I said, you're not about to sit here and play with me. And that's what I told her in that chair. I was like, I'm not about to sit here and play with you. We, this is what we're not about to do. Like, you're No, absolutely not. So, yeah. Thank y'all. I needed to. I needed to get that out of my spirit. Now I'm about to go home, eat my dinner, <laughs> maybe make a video or edit a video. We shall see. Yeah, but yeah, I just needed to. I needed to get that out my spirit, out my psyche. <laughs> All right, peace. All right, so I just wanted to show because I know it was dark in my car when I was recording. So I want you to see the close up. Don't pay attention to my hair. I'm. <laughs> Today was just a running errand day, getting stuff done that I needed to get done. I expected to have my lashes done. Um, this, 
and I'm not trying to pull on it too much because I don't want to rip my natural lashes off um but yeah see this how this is split right here that's not supposed to be like that this is practically like lifting up um like I said yesterday I wash my face like I normally do I always wash you go wash your face you know and half my lashes came off like I didn't do nothing extra nothing aggressive or anything I wash you wash your face <laughs> um do, you know it's like submerging my head in water or nothing it, whatever I did yesterday was no thing for my lashes to come off in three days okay and like I said uh, I never want to say it free service like I don't even do free service like so I don't know if that's what she thought in her head like she had a preconceived notion that I wanted free service which I never even asked for especially when I come in there all the time so I don't know I'm confused anyway let's neither here nor there I'm going above <laughs> I'm going above her and her little nasty attitude and this issue is going to get resolved because I don't I don't tolerate disrespect like you are a business your priority should be to make sure that your customers are satisfied especially somebody that you know spends money regularly uh, I, I, i'm at a loss for words okay we're not gonna make this long drawn out to the point i just wanted to show i already said what i said i'm not gonna keep repeating myself um it's, it's gonna be handled i got this i got this peace don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and make sure you turn on the notification bell. Follow me on social media. I am way more active on my Instagram page, um, but I also have Twitter as well. You can click the link tree. It'll take you directly to all of my links, and have a good one. Bye.